That trophy will be part of the national championship parade. That's right. And CBS 46's Savannah Louie is live for us in Athens and Savannah. This celebration, 41 years in the making. Yeah, 41 years. That's probably why we're seeing so many people coming out in droves because you don't know when this could happen again. I'll show you the trophy in just a minute, but first I want to show you all of these excited UGA fans, the community out here waiting to get their picture with the trophy. Uh, we're told that, yes, this does look like a very long line, but it takes maybe like 45 minutes or so to get through. Uh, and we're told that there are also going to be about like 3,000 people expected to be out here today. As for this trophy, yes, pretty amazing. A lot of folks weren't even around uh, last time they won. And for the folks who were here, well, they say it's been a long time coming. It was painful and then it was glorious. Bringing home a win with nostalgia. Alan Fleming driving to Athens from Marietta, traveling back in time. Just to be here and breathe the air of Athens, you know, again, and just feel the feeling. I was going to drive over here Monday night, but I said, you know, that's a little bit crazy. <laughs> the UGA alums visit mandate to stop here. The clubhouse downtown, a retailer restocking inventory every hour. It's quick, very quick. <laughs> it's like we can't keep up with, you know, online orders and customers in the store and that sort of thing. And putting things out, as you can see, we're trying to get it all out as fast as possible. Nonstop sales expected to peak Saturday when the dogs celebrate their win with a parade down Lumpkin Street to Sanford Stadium at 1230, followed by the dog walk and a formal ceremony. Tickets free for season ticket holders and students through Thursday, opening to the general public Thursday and Friday. This syllabus week, first week of the semester, so I think a lot of people will be out, a lot of people will be having fun and just celebrating the dogs win. More than 19,000 people come to Athens for major game days. Agencies can't predict the number of people expected here Saturday, but no doubt the dogs will show out in support. We don't really have enough parking in hotels to support all these folks, but uh, we're going to have folks coming from Atlanta, from South Georgia, I mean all over the, the southeast uh, and probably all over the country too. athens Clark County Police plan to patrol specific zones, oversee traffic detail, and add officers downtown for memories lasting long beyond our lifetimes. I mean, it's a blessing, so, you know, it's something to tell to my kids, you know, when I, like, grow up. All right, now I do want to note that uh, this is a very exciting experience for a lot of folks out here. If you do plan on coming out, you have to get here before 7 o'clock because there is going to be a hard out at 7 o'clock. They're not staying late if you decide to show up late. Now, I also spoke with the city of Athens. They warned me that one concern ahead of the event is some of the winter weather we are expecting when it comes to snow, freezing temperatures. So if you do decide to come up here, just be prepared for that. Reporting live from Athens, Savannah Louis, CBS 46 News. All right.